Hi ladies, it's Christina and I'm just going to show you the journal I made. No, it's not a journal. This is the Junk Mini and it is a swap that I'm doing over at Your Paper Pantry. And so Roxy, this is your journal or your mini. So if you don't want to see it, then I guess you shouldn't watch anymore. Okay, so it's about seven inches by nine inches. Um, I tried to find, I went to the store to buy newspaper because I wanted to um, mod podge the travel section, but my paper didn't have the travel section and I was so pressed for time. But I did find kind of some fun stuff, see? Because this has to do with travel. Our theme is travel, whether it's, you know, camping or airplaning or, or whatever. But anyhow, so this is what I came up with. Oh, you look, look, rocks, you can even do, oh, maybe she's not watching, but look, you could even do, um, a crossword puzzle and then this part here I put some duct tape on so um, it would hold up better and then this is just one of those hair elastics that I um, I'm just holding it together and then on the inside I have some vintage type e ephemera here that I just used Mod Podge and glued it all on and then these are a whole bunch of stamps that I cut out and just Mod Podge those on bunch of fibers here, a bunch of ribbons that I attached to the rings and some travel charms and the front cover is just lightweight chipboard and I added some oh darn what is this called it's canvas that I glued on the front and the back and I've let and we're not supposed to we're you know what I found it really hard when you're doing a mini not to decorate it because we're trying to not decorate it so our partners can decorate it. So Roxy, I had a huge, it was so hard not decorating this. I mean, I could have added the kitchen sink to this. Anyhow, so I tried to leave a lot of things blank, but a lot of things aren't blank, so I'm sorry. So this is the front page. It's just front and back is canvas, so I did leave that blank and you can do whatever you want with that. This is a paper bag that I covered with some travel paper. Um, little, a couple of little tiny, little tiny paper bags, and there's just some um, vintage tags inside. And these are these are like brads, but they have you know they say travel. They're little beads that say travel and vacation. And these little guys come out too. These are so cute. And then the other side of the envelope is just plain, so Roxy can do what she wants here. Uh, these are some of those airmail envelopes. And I like the inside of that too. I love those. I love these envelopes. Okay, so here is some, just some blank um, lined paper. And then, oh, let me find it. At the thrift store, a long time ago, I found this book here, and it's called Camp Journal. So I ripped it apart and used a lot of the inside in this mini book. So see, these are some of the pages. And my camera's going beep, beep. It's flashing. That means my battery's low, so I'm going to go fast. So here's some pages of fun little flip-flops. Ledger paper, more lined paper. Uh, I forget what these are called, some chip chipboard uh, negatives. So one is plain and one is embossed. Also in that camp journal, they were these like really thick uh, chipboard type postcard pages. So I just added some tabs, and then if Roxy wants to divide this album up, she can you know write some names on here. Here's a pocket. This pocket, um, there's a Carlene at uh, has. Um, I'll put her link below or her YouTube channel. She has a tutorial on how to make this pocket here um, with just one piece of pattern paper. So thanks, Carlene. Here's a little envelope. And what did I put in here? Oh yeah, I have a tag. It's a tag that Roxy can use in her book. It's a travel tag. Just some neat little vintage postcards here. And then there's the back. And then I made some really big tags. And then left them plain for Roxy to do what she wants. Some ledger paper that I scrunched up. This is a little, I don't know what these are called, it's just a little plastic pocket and there's all kinds of little vintage uh, travel images in there. Uh, paper bag. This is one of those airmail envelopes that I 
use some pattern paper to decorate it. And then the inside, there's some um, vintage ephemera in there. And then there's a couple paper bags here. This side I didn't do anything with. Um, these two sides I decorated up. And there's some pockets here and a pocket here. And then I added some paper bags and Roxy can do what she wants with those. This is really light chipboard that I painted with pink, um, pink, um, shiny type paint and added a really neat, uh, lay, um, um, Paris type photo there. And some patterned paper, just plain patterned paper. These are CD. Um, CD holders, so I added a bunch of those, and you can decorate those up. I'll show you one I just used some pattern paper on. See, I just um, glued some pattern paper on, so Roxy can do what she wants with that. Those, some more paper bags, another one of these plastic pockets with some um, travel charms in there, and some more tags, two little paper bags. Another paper bag that I just covered the front and the back, left it plain, Roxy can do what she wants, and just added some fun stickers. And then the last page, again, is a, a canvas that I left plain, and then the back page is a collage of um, vintage travel ephemera. And that's that! So there you go, that's my video. I have to, I'm making this really fast because I can see my little um, power batteries flashing. I wonder how long I have left. Okay, so that's it. Thanks for watching, everybody. Have a great day. Bye.